A University of Kentucky law student charged after his drone crash landed at Commonwealth Stadium went before a judge this afternoon. Police say Peyton Wilson's drone went down inside the stadium just minutes before UK's game against Louisiana Lafayette back in September. Kristen Kennedy spoke with Wilson's attorney who says he does not believe the charges are warranted. Peyton Wilson's attorney told us outside the courtroom that his client shouldn't be punished for cooperating with UK police. At worst, what happened here is a mistake. And we do not think that the government should try to criminalize mistakes. Attorney Luke Morgan's client Peyton Wilson entered a not guilty plea in court Tuesday afternoon. He's charged with wanton endangerment. Officers say he flew his drone dangerously close to a parachutist skydiving into Commonwealth Stadium right before a game. The drone, police say, then drops down inside the packed stadium. Thankfully, nothing bad happened. We think we're confident that when this is before a jury, that this matter, uh, Peyton will be found not guilty. And we believe that it is uh, wrong for the government to criminalize something that they have not even found enough time to regulate. The Federal Aviation Administration is about to. They announced Monday a new rule. They'll soon start requiring all recreational drone owners to register their aircraft. The FAA hopes to have new regulations in place by the end of the year. In Lexington, Kristen Kennedy for the Fox 56 10 o'clock news. Wilson's attorney says the FAA has contacted them to review the case.